Hello, hello. Day four, a week of grace. Day four, a week of grace. My two words are symbol and authority. Um, speaking about a woman's head and her hair and her covering. Um, this is my workout proof. My two words are symbol and authority. No. <laughs> I, was, I, I wanted to do authority, but that word was kind of long, so I had, had to have a chat. <laughs> and um, it's head. H-E-A-D. Head. So I'm going to work on quite a few workouts here. I'm going to start with the letter S in symbol. Which is 10 clock lines. We have a different, different alphabet. Staying hip with the part. Thrust your hip forward, 12 o'clock, 3 o'clock, 6 o'clock, go back, 9 o'clock, opposite side, 12 o'clock. So that's the direction of the wind. So you want to wind in the right direction and the left. So I'm going to go five lines to the right. One, two, three, four, five. And then five to the left, so that'd be 12 o'clock, nine o'clock, six o'clock to the back, three o'clock, 12 o'clock. You're thrusting your hips to the side back. All right, here we go. Opposite direction, five o'clock line. One, two, three, Four, five, for the letter S in symbol. I also have a Y, which is um, 10 lunges, 10 lunges. This water is uh, too deep to lunge in, so I'm gonna move on to um, M, which is 10 standing crunches. I'll do all of my shallow water workouts in the three feet but the pool is kind of deep, so <laughs> I'll try my best. Here we go. So you wanna throw your arms together. You can do it with a weight. I'll do five without a weight, and then five with a weight. This is our new alphabet. Welcome, welcome, hashtag WOB Spring 2024. Okay, here we go for the letter M. Arms folded, knees, are hip width apart. You don't want them close and tight. You want to hip width apart and you want to bend just a little. Bend those knees just a little to take the pressure off your back and crunch your belly. Suck in, but make sure you breathe it. Inhale, exhale. Make sure you're still sucking in and crunch. One, two, we're crunching our belly. Three, four, five. Okay, I'm gonna grab a weight. In fact, I'm going to grab two weights. You can do one weight or two weights. It depends on your level of workout. I've been doing this for quite a while, so I'm going to use two. And here we go. One, two. The resistance changed the workout. I feel it now in the bottom of my core. That was 10 for the letter M. You just put your weights in a cross, just like that, and you're able to hug it, just like that. You can bring those knees up too. But this was, that was a standing crunch. That wasn't a um, knees up crunch, that was a standing crunch. Okay, moving forward, I am going to um, do quite a few jumping jacks um, from some of my previous workouts for this week and then I'll come back and finish off today's workout all right so I would like to show you water weights these are two pounds they can go on your wrist in this fashion They can go on your wrist. In this fashion. And 
can go on your ankle in that fashion. And you can actually punch and kick at the same time or opposite legs. This is just a sidebar as I was putting on my weights for my jumping jacks. I just wanted to share that with you. All right, challengers, warriors, let's get the workout. Let's get physical, physical. All right, we have ease, 25 arm circles back, and I have 25 arm circles forward from another word. So I'm gonna do both, two, three. I try to get my shoulders under, five. I try to stay under, six, seven. So my lighting has changed. Let me change position so you can see me. Be right back. Amazing what lighting can do. <laughs> when, when you're recording your workouts, whether you're in the pool, in the gym, whether you're at home, it's best to put the light behind the camera, therefore it shines on you, Ta -da! and you can see me now. All right, 25 arm circles back. I'll sit down so I can get my shoulders under. Let's go, let's get it, let's get it. I only got 12 minutes left, so I'm gonna do just a couple of them and I need to clean my phone. From season to season, I would just drop this tidbit. From season to season, if you share your proof in the group, there's no need for you to keep it in your phone. You can delete, delete, trash, trash, so you have room to record for the next season. Okay, because your phone will get full. Trust me, here we go. One, two, Three, pull. One, two, three, pull. This is a high, high knee, 10 high knee to metro draw. And you wanna do what you do to the right, you wanna do to the left, two, three, one, two, three. So I'm pulling my shin along with my knee up to my chest. So I can really get a good pull and a good bend on my knees in the water. This is a good workout for arthritic knees that won't bend. Straighten them out, bend them on your own, and then get a little force. Ah, that was six. Here we go. And keep going. Four more. Deep breath, make sure you breathe in. Seven. If I lost count, I'm going to do a couple more just to make sure because I'm talking, I tend to lose count. Eight, that left knee is really bending good. The right knee can bend more. And with the weights on, mm, bend me. In Jesus' name, nine, bend, bend, nine, bend, bend, and ten. That was 10 metro drum to high knee pull, which is the letter D. So I'm knocking out the letter, um, um, lock, knocking out the word head. Knocking out the word head. H, H would be next, which is 10 squat to high kick reach. Uh, let me see if I can squat here. 
Can you see? Squat. Mm. Water kind of deep. Kick, reach, one. Squat. Kick, reach, two. Squat. Kick, reach. Kick, reach. To the front, right leg, one. Right direction, halo to the front, two. Right leg, right direction to the front, three. If you don't put your weight in the water, you won't get wet. Four. Five, and I'm gonna do 10, so I'm gonna do the opposite direction. To the left, halo, now left leg, one. Halo, deep breath. Two, halo, deep breath, three, halo, deep breath, four, you wanna exhale, right when the leg come up, five. Praise God, that was 10. That was 10, leg raise to halo. All right, what else I got? Um, 10, I mean T was 20 bent over row. I'm mixing my words up, but I, I, I'm gonna check it off. You'll see in the group. Here we go. In fact, I'm gonna stop this one and go ahead and check it off. I don't wanna do all these workouts and I don't check off the letters to go with the words. And I know what I'm meditating on today, but I'm also meditating on what God told me yesterday, which is imitate Christ. So that's the letters I'm doing now with the T. Nine, it's the bend over roll. So you want to bend over and roll. And your elbows come out. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Not holding my breath, not really sucking in, I'm just engaging it. Just engage your core. Engage your core, man. <laughs> Woman, engage your core. Be blessed, Warrior Thunder out. This is my workout proof for today. Let's go. Let's get it, get it, get it, get it. Bless the Lord. Love y'all. God loves you more.